Good evening. Welcome to Friday's Midlands Today from the BBC. Well, coming up here in a moment on Midlands Today. One of our major hopes for the 2012 Olympics has been describing how he nearly died in America. Oliver Townend was competing to become the first man ever to complete a Grand Slam in three-day eventing when he fell from his horse. The fall was so bad, he says, if it wasn't for a new piece of safety equipment, his dreams and indeed his life could have been over. Ben Sidwell reports. Unbelievable fall. Takes your breath away, that does, doesn't it? Yeah, that oh, air jacket. Oh, in the studio when I we know, saw we that. did, yeah. That mm -hmm. air jacket, incredible invention, isn't yeah. it? Get well soon, Oliver. Yeah, indeed. Now, 90 years ago in the First World War, Private Frederick Dancox received the highest award for bravery, the Victoria Cross. But until now, there's been no memorial to him in his home city. That changed today, and some of Private Dancox's descendants were there to see it happen. Here's our reporter, Kath Mackey. Hoping for a long, sunny mm. summer to come. I don't know about that. Do you know about that piece? Okay. Yes. Let's have a look at tonight's main headlines. And that's all from us this evening and for this week. Thanks for being with us. Have a lovely have a weekend, night. won't you? Bye-bye.